In this video, I'm going to be talking about single room air extraction units and those which have well, not just an extraction fan but those that do heat recovery. And as you'll see in this video, uh, some of these can give you an 85% heat recovery. So that means you're going to bring fresh air into the room, take out the stale rotten air and still maintain 85% of the heat energy that was in that air that's being extracted. So why is it so important to have single room mechanical air extraction units? Well, I'll tell you why. Uh, Tensor and uh, HeatingSafe were involved in the largest project, monitoring project, the country has ever known, where we monitored some just short of 100 houses in um, uh, Salford, uh, near Manchester. And um, we did this over a two year period. We collected almost three billion transactions. And what those transactions showed, because we were measuring carbon dioxide levels, that in some of the bedrooms in these houses, the CO2 levels reached 2,000 parts per million which frankly is, is very, very unhealthy. Now, you could solve a lot of these problems by employing single room air extraction units which have got some element of heat recovery. And uh, today we are in the, one of the laboratories, one of the test laboratories of Heating Save, where we've installed one of these devices and we're monitoring exactly how it functions and how well it performs. And I can tell you this particular one has got an 85% heat recovery. And we've got the data to prove all of this. So if you install these with a heating safe system, heating safe can monitor the CO2 levels and also other things like the sound levels with inside the room and other conditions like uh, um, temperature and relative humidity. And then it can make the decision to not only turn on this extraction unit, but also the speed at which the fan can run. Because if you want to extract the air, uh, say because it's reaching 2,000 parts per million of carbon dioxide, or it's particularly damp, because dampness and mould is another problem, what you can do is you can do that extraction, but if it's in a bedroom at night, if you turn the thing on full blast, you're going to wake everybody up. So here, heating safe can intelligently vary the speed of this fan so we improve the conditions for the people living in the building but at the same time we're doing it in a way that's acceptable to them. Because if this same circumstances uh, existed say in the lounge in the evening, so people are smoking, uh, CO2 levels are going up, maybe there's a lot of people there, you can do the same thing, but with a lot of background noise from the television, and don't forget heating safe can monitor things like sound levels too. Uh, we could run the fan a lot faster, extract the air more quickly to make the, the room particularly healthy as far as air conditions are concerned. But um, it wouldn't disturb the occupants because they're all busy watching television. But obviously in a bedroom at night when it's quiet, you have to run the fans a lot more slowly. So what are one of these single room extraction, air extraction units actually look like. Well we have one on the wall here. So this is the unit itself and you'll notice that because this is in one of our R&D labs we've also here got a temperature sensor which is monitoring the temperature of the air that's coming in and inside the unit we have another temperature sensor which is monitoring the air that's uh, going outside. And we have yet another temperature sensor here to measure what the room temperature is a short distance away from the extraction unit itself. On the outside wall, where you have a single room extraction system, uh, sort of a single room MVHR type sort of system installed, then uh, you have a vent. And this is the vent behind me here. And this vent, you'll notice, has basically two orifices. One of them here is taking the air that is um, coming in, and then this higher one here is the air that's being blown out. 
And from our results, and you can go onto the Heating Save website and, and see some of these results, and we've got the graphs from Heating Save to look at that, you can see exactly how effectively this has worked, uh, how it, it, it recovers that heat, 85% of it, but also, most importantly, seriously lowers the CO2 levels and the relative humidity. Thank you.